<laughs> oh man. What's up guys and welcome to the Uncharted Nathan Drake Collection demo. If you didn't know the Nathan Drake Collection is a collection of Uncharted 1 through 3 being fully remastered on the PlayStation 4 and gameplay shows that it looks amazing and it releases this October and we have a demo to show it off in the play and Oh man, I'm just, I can't even explain how excited I am. I love Uncharted, it's one of my favorite franchises, and of course Naughty Dog is one of my favorite developers of all time. So, I can't wait. Why don't we play some of the demo and see what it has in store for us? Whoa, okay. Looks like we're starting in Uncharted 2 here. Oh, I remember this all too well. That was unpleasant. You must have hit a generator. Give me a hand. A little more. Nate, move. It's no good. I'm gonna have to fix the power to get you out. You gonna be okay? Yeah, I wish I'd brought something to read. Looks like the circuit breaker's on the top floor. Just sit tight, I'll take care of it. Oh, and here we go. Oh man. Does it look good? The funny thing is, is this, this is the level... It's out and a girl's trapped. I swear to God, if there's a zombie around the next corner... <laughs> I remember that reference. But either way, this is one of the levels I remember from Uncharted 2 that made me think, wow, did this game look good? Was this area... There were some points earlier in the game, too, that I wish I would have touched up on, but this area in general, the dynamic lighting through the windows coming in from the broken parts of the building, it all looks fantastic, and whenever you want to, you can look out the window and see mountains and destroyed buildings and just an entire city, and it all looks fabulous. The sunlight coming in from the clouds is like, ah, it's perfect. I love it. I'm sorry. I'm a fanboy. <laughs> well, with that being said, let's actually play the game. Of course, it feels interesting. Right off the bat on a PS4 controller, of course, I'm used to the PS3 controller, which is a little bit lighter. Oh no, watch out, Drake, ouch. And of course, all of this Uncharted collection madness is to celebrate the fact that Uncharted 4 will be coming out on the PlayStation 4 on March 2016, so we only have a few more months to go, and I'm excited for all of it, but you guys should let me know if you want to see more Uncharted uh, Nathan Drake collection, or if you want to see Uncharted 4. Of course, we know how to do most of this here. Let's see, I can't wait to see what the combat feels like in this game with the PS4 controller. Now, it has been about a year or so since I've last played Uncharted, so might be... Oh, yeah, I remember. There's going to be some guys showing up here, I think. Uh, maybe not this window, but a window somewhere. Oh, there they are. There they are. Okay. Hmm, so we're going to hide on this ledge here and wait for him. And, oh, it is gorgeous. It just... I love the fluidity. And then, boom. <laughs> oh, I tried for that headshot. Didn't really get it. That's okay. I got that. <laughs> I could have gone for a stealth take down there, but I really just want to see some of the gunplay right now. Oh, there he is. Hi, bye. Ooh, the moss. I love the moss. Here. Uh, there you go. See? Th that's why I love the moss. <laughs> okay, so you also get some of these, the propane tanks, which you can throw and then shoot with. Um, oh, hi. How are you? Uh, what button do you press to throw this? Uh, I pressed the wrong button, but it's usually that. <laughs> All right, let's switch. I'm used to pressing triangle to switch weapons in most games, but for this one, it's the directional pad, which I forgot about. Oh, well, I'm not doing so great right now. Oh, jeez, which is funny because I've actually gotten pretty close to beating this game on the hardest difficulty, the hardcore mode. Oh, that missed. There you go. And it's just awesome that at any point in time, you can look out and see a wonderful world outside the window. I can't wait to see the rest of the game, you know. I tried to do touched upon a variety of environments, you know. It had the frozen tundra with all the wintry mountains, and it also had, you know, places like this, and of course, there are many, many jungles. And then tried to through the same thing, even touching upon a desert, so. I'm excited to see, you know, these all these different environments and beautiful 1080p HD. Let's see, hmm, yep, let's go over here. Oh, no, there you guys are. Oh, I was gonna try to hit that propane tank, but that didn't really work. <laughs> All right, now you, ooh, there you go. That's what I wanted. <laughs> All right, so I'm out of ammo here. Let me pick up some. Oh, I'll just take the AK for now. Well, the moss is fun. It can be a little difficult to aim, so sometimes it can't be worth its uh, due respects. Okay, where do we go here? Hmm, I don't know, but I just like looking at this. <laughs> I think we, yeah, we gotta go up here. Whoa, whoa, wrong button. I wanted to climb that. <laughs> well, the deaths are still just as silly as ever. Oh yeah, there used to be are they going to have the treasure over here, or did they hide that? Because you can find some treasure over here. Ah, uh, they don't have it. Oh, that would have been awesome. You know, just get a little achievement for finding some of the treasure in the demo. 
<laughs> but let's talk about how Nathan looks. Like Nathan looks awesome. You can tell that his face, like face detail has been picked up a bit. You can see more details like in his hair. You can see some awesome lighting off the back of his gun when he runs. It just, there's all these small details that seem to have more attention now because there's room for it. All right, let's hop up here. Nope, nope, okay. Okay, Nathan, come on. <laughs> Why is, ah. All right, so what we're supposed to do is simply just go on over here. Yep, and not swing off like a maniac. All right, now we can make our way over here. And it's just cool to see this, I don't know. As somebody who like, you know, I spent a lot of time playing Uncharted back on the PS3. It was like the big franchise that I spent so much time in. So it's cool to see. You haven't forgotten about me, have you? Nope, I have not. <laughs> Nate's not even gonna respond. Okay, so down here should be the generator. Yep, okay, so no enemies, right? Uh, none that I see, at least for right now. I think we need to just go up and press this, right? Yep, all right, do it. <laughs> Cool, cool. So I wonder if there's gonna be any additional features. I, I snooped around the options menu and I didn't notice anything. But it would be very cool if they added some, you know, new PS4 related features. Maybe like motion controls with the controller or something similar would be awesome, as long as it's optional. Like I like seeing that kind of stuff as long as it has like optional abilities. So where are we going? I think, oh yeah, that's right. She needs to help us here. So you're gonna help us up. She goes. Yeah, nice job. Oh, I think you're liking this a bit too much. Now she's gonna knock down the ladder for us. But it's just, I don't know, I love seeing the detail on things like the walls. You can see like there's individual details. It's not just the same pattern repeated. You know, you can see some, you know, some discoloration here that you don't see anywhere else on the walls too much. And I like that it's not just one repeated pattern over and over again. All right, let's go up here. And ooh, it's looking pretty nice up here, right? Oh, oh yeah, I remember this area. It, yeah, it's the pool area. <laughs> Hey, check it out. Marco. Really? Come on. No. Marco. Hello. Fish out of water. You are so unprofessional. I love it so much. And there used to be some uh, secrets over around here too. I think it's actually on the other side. You would find a treasure like over here maybe? I don't know, there was something around here like that. Of course, like I said before, it doesn't seem like they have them. Oh, you know, it may be in front of the sign, but of course, this is one of the best views you get in the entire game when it comes to height perspective and just the amount of things you can see. You know, you can see all of the buildings, the water, the mountains, everything that sort of looks really great. <laughs> but we also get some scary music. Why don't we climb to the very top where a cutscene should trigger way up here? Something like that? Hmm. Oh, you know what we have to do? We have to come over here. All right, then. Let's climb on up. And of course, the climbing feels as simple as it ever has been on the PS4 controller. You know, most things are pretty native since the PS4 controller doesn't have a ton of differences when it comes, you know, compared to the PS3. It's just sort of slightly schematically different. But overall, it still works just about the same. Well, here we are. Now we just gotta find the right temple. Well, that may be easier said than done. No, tell me about it. Maybe we can... Oh, bingo. There it is. That's the one. Yeah, it's gotta be. The one in the middle of Ow. all the gunfire and explosions. Lucky us. Nate, that's right where Lazarevich is camped. I was hoping we'd be headed in the opposite direction. Well, desperate times, right? The wreck has been spotted in Sector 18. Oh, crap. Any chance this is Sector 19? Sweep the city, find him, and take him out. Son of a bitch. All right, time to go. Come on, Nate, let's get moving. Ooh, oh man, look at the sun coming from the clouds. <laughs> I would get moving if it wasn't for the fact that we have beautiful things to look at. All right, we're gonna head down here. Then this is where things get a little more gruesome when it comes to the action. So hopefully we get to see everything in motion a bit more. Oh God, be careful. Ooh, uh oh, uh-oh. This ain't good. <laughs> go, 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 go! Oh no! Alright, let's go down. Oh, there you go. And this is one of the many incredibly hectic and intense scenes in Uncharted. <laughs> go, 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 come on. Oh, 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 no! Oh no. Hold on, Drake, hold on. Come on, come on, come on. Oh, actually, we might want to hang on to this here and take care of him. 
So I'm playing on normal difficulty at the moment. They only gave us two options. They gave us easy and normal. So we don't get a taste of what some of the more difficult things are, like crushing difficulty. We'll be getting a taste of that today. But it's, you know, basically the same. It's just we get damaged more. Ouch! Okay, I didn't even notice the propane tank. Let's throw a grenade. What button is grenade again? There we go. It's L1. Hey, buddy. <laughs> you just sort of snuck up on me. All right, doing a little better here. Was able to take out some of those guys before they started really hitting me. Now, there should be some guys down here we gotta be ready for. Yeah, they're gonna start sneaking out here in a moment. Whoa, I forgot about that. It's always cool when you can re-experience it. And that's why I'm excited for Uncharted 4. You know, it's like this Uncharted um, collection is very awesome for just reliving these awesome moments, but it's also cool not to expect this stuff and know it's coming after playing it so many times. I'm excited to play through Uncharted 1 because it was a very long time since I really have played through Uncharted 1 and I didn't play through it that dedicated compared to Uncharted 2 and 3. So I'm excited. Ooh, how'd that feel, buddy? <laughs> All right, let's keep going. But yeah, Uncharted 3 was probably the pinnacle when it comes to my Uncharted playthroughs because with Uncharted 3, I actually marathon the in basically the entire game. I think I played it through in like two segments or the first one was a little shorter than the second one. And I played the game for like 10 hours straight. I just couldn't put it down. It was perfect, I love that. All right, we're not doing so great right now. I need to be duck and covered, duck and covered. Okay, there you go. We're dying a lot here. <laughs> I just gotta get used to the game again. Oh, geez. Of course, with the demo, it sort of plops you into some of the more difficult parts. Oh, no. I remember this part being tough. Uh, we gotta be careful. Um, oh, no. It's, oh, no, here it goes, here it goes. Gonna knock down the building, right? Uh oh. Oh no. Oh geez. And there's still enemies around. Why are they? Why are they here? <laughs> no, 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 no. Oh geez. No. Dang it. Worst timing. Oh geez. Oh geez. I remember this. We gotta jump. We gotta jump. We gotta jump. Hold on. Oh. Yes. <laughs> awesome. <laughs> we were. We were almost in that. <laughs> and I'm rather surprised for how long this demo's going on. We're still playing here. All right, we need some more ammunition. Ooh, nice. I love this one. Okay, then. So this one's a nice little one-shot kill with everything. Way, come on. Yeah, let's go up here. Get a little bit of a calm after the storm that I love. Guess we caught this hotel in the down season, huh? Ha <sighs> Come on. I, just, I love how the game flows with commentary from the characters and everything. It, just, it always fits well. All right. Um, oh, and I remember this. It's like this rural setting sometimes with like the kitchens and the everything. It can look pretty cool. All right, so what do we got to deal with here? Oh, there's probably going to be some guys popping up. Oh, here they are. All right, buddy. Ready? Bye. No, I missed yet. Oh, darn it. Oh, geez, the rocket launchers. Or oh, they're more grenade launchers, aren't they? All right. Luckily, with this gun, it is all one-shot kills if you can actually land the shot. <laughs> I love it so much. It's just tough to land that shot. Then let's see. I'm trying to use as much of a variety of guns that I can possibly can. I just built them to get across the roof. Lucky for us. Why is that not? Am I not tapping fast enough, really? <laughs> Hold on. Oh, come on. Go, 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 go. There you go. But yeah, I'm trying to use as much of a variety of guns as I possibly can so that, you know, we can get a sense of them all and how they work. Okay, let's go over here, and then... Ooh, I, I hear something not good. Uh, yeah, let's get rid of all you. Come on. They're all grouped up. It's a perfect opportunity. Here, throw that grenade over there. Just in case there's a few I didn't get. I don't know. <laughs> there's dead bodies flying everywhere. Okay, let's climb up here. And I think we gotta... Yeah, go down here. Ooh. Oh no! It's back. This guy doesn't give up. Get down! All right. So what we have to do here is actually land our shots with the grenade launcher, which I've missed every one of them. <laughs> okay. Go 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 go. Oh geez, not good, not good. So we just need to wait around, get as much ammo as we can, and take care of this airplane. These guys are jerks. Don't like them one bit. Okay. Uh, no, please don't. <laughs> Yeah, let's get more ammo. What's hard is sometimes some enemies will pop up when we're doing this, so we gotta be careful. Oh, getting down a little bit more. Yep, I think some enemies are starting to pop up now. Okay, ouch, 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 ouch. Yep, here they are, here they are. The whole gang's here. Um, let's see. <laughs> it's good when you can hit it and duck and cover, but it's not an easy thing to do. Hmm, where are the enemies? They're over here. So we're going to deal with you and then shoot one at you as well. Nice, okay. Oh, hey, hey, no, wrong way. <laughs> I would like to get some normal, oh, okay, there we go. 
It's trying to tutorialize me right now, and it's not really working out for anybody. All right, um, shoot. Yes, okay, let's try to get one more. No, we missed that one. All right, I need some more ammo, so let's try to get some, and then I'm getting, putting, got a lot of holes on me right now. They're treating me like some cardboard. Okay, um, whew. nope, okay, that one hit the, the propellers. Okay, oh boy, not good, not good. Uh, I need more backup from Chloe here. All right, we're almost there, I'm sure of it. Oh no, oh no, no, no. Okay. Hopefully, we get some freedom from enemies, but I do hear gunshots, so they're probably like right over my head. Oh well, uh, oh, there we go, nice, John. Right above my head, and down it goes. Down she goes! So there we go, that's actually the end of the demo there. Thanks for playing the Uncharted Nathan Drake Collection demo. So you only get a little bit of a taste of the Uncharted 2. I would love to see some Uncharted 1 and 3 in there, but of course, Uncharted 2 being one of the best out of the series, I'm not surprised why. Of course, once the Uncharted Nathan Drake Collection comes out, on the PS4 this October, I think it's October 13th or something. Well, when that happens, it will, um, you'll also get a PS4 Uncharted 4 beta code, is what it is. And we'll be trying that on the channel. I definitely want to see some of the online mode for all of that, because Uncharted Online is actually surprisingly good. But either way, thank you guys so much for watching. If you enjoyed this video of the demo, make sure to give it a like, share with your friends and family, and comment in the comment section below. What do you think about the Uncharted Nathan Drake collection? Are you excited for it? Would you like to see some gameplay on it? But either way, thank you guys so much for watching. I will see you next time. Bye-bye.